Hey, this is Kyle. Today we're going to be looking at a 2015 Chrysler Town & Country. Uh, this is the Touring model. And it does have uh, the automatic slide doors. As well as the powered trunk. This is an Arizona van. Very clean. Got some assurance tires on there. Let's go ahead and pop the trunk. This is the uh, flex fuel because it's the Pentastar, the 3.6 liter. As you can see, it's three rows of seats. Uh, the stone go seats, so you can drop them down and put them in the floor and get uh, more cargo room for the inside. These minivans are uh, very spacious from what I've used with all that cargo room. And all the doors power as well. Nice, comfy leather seats. This is a uh, silver van uh, with a black interior. And as you can see, it's pretty clean. It's got the uh, WeatherTech floor mats. Some assurance tires again. So it's a matching set. You see these vans all over the place down here. Uh, this is a Sun City uh, owned van down here in Arizona. Uh, and that's a community for uh, senior citizens. So you know it's a well taken care of van. It's more comfy leather seats for the driver and passenger. We are showing 96,391 miles. Uh, this is a window lock uh, because these back windows uh, do go down about halfway, I believe. Um, this would lock the door so they can't, children, if they're in the back, can't open the door by themselves. The driver would have to press it on the button up there. If you've never uh, been in a Chrysler minivan before, the controls are very simple to operate. Put the key in the ignition right here. And we'll just turn it. There's their famous Uconnect system, uh, which is radio, AM, FM, satellite, as well as uh, hard drive, disc, and auxiliary, which you can use an auxiliary to your phone, or you can do Bluetooth. It does have Sirius, if, which is the satellite. You have your analog clock here, uh, your venting with your simple to operate controls here. This is your fan control and your temperature. And then if you want the front uh, to match with the rear, you would just click sync. So that matches the rear as well as the passenger and the driver. And as you can see, they have auto fan uh, for whatever set temperature you have. This is 70 degrees out. It has Econ. The blinkers. 115 volt power is for a regular um, power outlet that we have in the rear. And then traction control. This is your uh, transmission shifter. It is an automatic, so you just put your foot on the brake, shift it into reverse, and it does have that backup camera as well. It has the garage door opener button right there. Let's take a peek at that. Almost 300 horsepower, 3.6 liter, Pentastar. 
you just go up here, you find the opener, you push it to the side. It's got a big old Duralast battery in it. Fill with our 134A, and the air conditioner does work well in this minivan. Overall pretty clean under here, a little dusty, but Uh, those are automatic headlights. And again, the WeatherTech floor mats that are placed all around this vehicle. So here's your power outlets uh, right here on the uh, driver's rear. You have a regular car cigarette lighter here as well as USBs and a regular 150 watt uh, power outlet for a laptop or something, which is what that uh, button up front was, as well as some video displays, uh, HDMI, as well as your component, RCA. You also have the storage pockets back here. And right here, you have the screen uh, that the HDMI port and RCA ports are you used for. Alternatively, you can just uh, use the radio with it uh, because this minivan did not come equipped with the DVD console. That would be right here. Otherwise, there's your rear ventilation as well as more storage. So all of these are storage. The rear also has their own climate control system. You can see uh, some water bottle holders in the doors over there and over here as well. Just press that button, it'll automatically close that door. And overall, I believe this minivan is just a, uh, a great driver. It gets almost 30 miles per gallon on the highway in my use. He's just looking for the uh, next owner. Thanks for watching.